Hello, this is Q Green, and I'm going to do an herb for today, which will be oregano. So with oregano, oregano is great for people that have whooping cough, the cough, the flu, um, high blood pressure, heart issues, hearing issues, infections, headaches, liver problems or diseases, tapeworms, joint pain, cuts, acne, arthritis, eczema, age spots, aging, allergies, blood clots because it is a blood thinner, jaundice, psoriasis, eczema, dry skin, acne, blemishes. Now it's antibacterial, it's antiviral, it's an antioxidant, it's anti-malarial, it's a decongestant, it's an expectorant, it's a muscle relaxant, it's a sedative, a blood thinner. It's therapeutic, it's anti-inflammatory, antiseptic, meaning like you can use it as your hydrogen peroxide. It's a disinfectant. You know how everybody's looking for disinfectants? It's a natural disinfectant, it's a germicide, it's a brain enhancer, and it's antifungal. It has good vitamins in it as well, like calcium, iron, camphor, fiber, magnesium, potassium, zinc, Vitamin A, vitamin B3, B12, B6, vitamin C, vitamin K, and vitamin E. Now, it is used to detox the lungs. Now, what it does is it clears the respiratory tract and the airways in the lungs. Now, allergies, it enters your body and it irritates the lungs, which leads to the colds, um, coughs, sore throats, your sinuses, and guess what? That causes the mucus to build up. So, the oregano expels the phlegm from the lungs and it helps people with their breathing. So therefore, you don't have to have those you know, issues breathing. You can take the oregano and it will help you because it does, does really work as far as your respiratory area, so it does help the lungs. Now, the vitamin K, it is high in vitamin K, which means it maintains a healthy heart. Um, it keeps your bones healthy. It's a really big immunity booster. It helps with menstrual cramps. Um, it's 42 times more powerful than um, 42 times high in antioxidants, which is way more powerful than the apple. So yes, that would be chosen over a apple. It helps with hair and skin problems, skin infections, skin diseases, fungus on your nails, all of that. So you should get some oregano in your system and tr you can try to take it every day. It will help. It'll help to prevent all those issues. Also anti-cancerous too. So to help prevent towards all those issues if you decide to take it every day. But you cannot take large amounts. Again, you cannot take large amounts. And I state this stuff because a lot of people like to go and overdo stuff. You cannot do that. So, if you do take large amounts, you will get side effects like an upset stomach or nauseous. Um, you might vomit, um, skin irritation. So, yeah, you don't want to do that because you don't know what might happen. Now, like I said, it's really good for people who may have cancer or whatever. So, give it a try help you out and it's good for people with high blood pressure too because like I said it's a detox so it does help you out as far as with that and that is our herb for today something quick that's in your kitchen and yeah you can do that bat breath you can chew on the oregano if you want to um, you can make a tea out of it you can make a hair tonic a skin spray you can add it with some coconut oil and rub it on your skin you can chew the leaves. I mean, so you got different varieties here. Um, the oregano oil is very potent too. So if you don't want to use the actual fresh leaf or the dry leaf, you can purchase the oil. The oil is at vitamin shops. I did see some at a few grocery stores. So yeah, you can check those out too. Now, this is Q Green, and thanks for watching. Bye bye.